What is up everybody, my name is Tashig and welcome back to freaking Mario Bros 2, the last levels. Now in the last one we did actually save Peach and it was all fun and dandy and then I thought it was over just like any Mario game you think oh we saved Peach it must be over. Oh no, they gave me this world bloody 9 which I am so excited for. I mean I've had so much fun playing through the whole game. Why? Okay, so I guess that's just trying to trick me out. I mean, I've died lows, it took me freaking ages to do, and I'm rewarded with more stages. Isn't that freaking wonderful? I was actually hoping to be done with this once I done the World 8, because this has not been the most fun Mario game I've played, but it has been the most challenging one for definite. But this seems to be quite simple. I mean, I can just sort of cruise through this level. Just at my own pace, try not to get hit by anything. I mean, I don't like underwater levels as they are, but this one wasn't too bad. Hopefully it's just four of these as well, and it's not a world 10. And we can just sort of breeze through them all. Still underwater? This looks very familiar. I'm sure this was in the last stage. Am I supposed to be going- Oh, goodness, no, Lukito. Oh, you piece of shit, Lukito. Where's it gonna put me? Game over. You're a super player. We hope we'll see you again, Mario and staff. So I guess this just means that those levels, World 9, is just for the end part. And you actually have to complete it again to get back to those worlds. Which would suck, but basically I'm playing this on the Wii U, which has the power of save state. So what we can do is... Bibbidi bobbidi boop bop. And there we go, we're back in it. So we can actually complete World 9 thanks to the power of the Wii U and save states. So this won't be any sort of official. I don't know why it'd be official anyway. It's me trying to complete a Mario game. You know how it is, I want to do all the worlds. The Keto's making this very challenging, you piece of shit, Lakito. Don't go on this level then, I think it's the message we learned from that. Look at this, oh we're flying for it all now. Alright, stay down, Piranha Planty. Thank you. Oh, he's gone. He left me alone. Isn't that sweet of the kid? Look at these. Why are they got different textures behind them? <laughs> uh, can I not get it all the same? Is that the end of this world too as well? Man, these are far too easy. <laughs> Compared to all the ones leading up to it, this is a walk in the park. Oh. Is this, is this gonna be a boss level? Why is it so intense with the music? What's gonna happen? I feel like something's gonna come out of nowhere or something. I'm gonna jump on a sprang. It's cool. Oh, lava! Alright, hold up, hold up, hold up. There we go. We're not gonna die no more. More lava. That's cool. There's no enemies though. This is a little throw me off. Is it gonna be like a Bowser at the end? Should I go down a pipe? Should I try? I can go down it. Awesome! Happy music! I wish I was invincible though. That'd be pretty rad. I can do flips and stuff. Oh, that was it. Just for some coins. That better be it. I better not jump to my death. Is this put me back at the beginning? Oh, it's just here. That's fine then. I can deal with that. Ain't no bang. Why are these little cloudy thingies in the lava below us? What is up with them? And why does a pipe look like we should be able to run in? We can't go across lava. That stuff is like a pit to us. Oh my goodness, it is a Bowser. He was like, after the... I, I don't even know. <laughs> Not gonna do a little spring. Oh shit. Okay, that could have gone a lot worse. Could, oh, nope. Oh, that did go worse. <laughs> oh, what is this I have here? Oh, is this takes me up here? Is this the same place as down that pipe? Just a little bit to run along and then we just drop down to go face off Bowser and his many hammers. It does seem like this is exactly the same place if I went down the pipe. Isn't that exciting? And it puts me in the same place as well. Awesome. Why is the two entrances to one place? Maybe they're different, they just look exactly the same. Oh! Well! <laughs> did not try to do that, but apparently that is a thing. And there's the X. Oh, shit. Um, there we, go. there we go. There was a visible block in my way, and I thought I was trapped there, but luckily I wasn't. But we're back under the water, in the black underwater stage. Is this one's gonna show me all the enemies now? Is this what this is showcasing? What is that? Is that a P? Are these supposed to be letters? I feel like they might be. Maybe? Maybe they're like Japanese letters or something. Oh, fuck you, damn squiddy! Back into the darkness. That is this underwatery level. Oh my goodness, how high did he chuck that? Yeah, so... Oh goodness, I can't get past the squid. Okay, waiting it out. Get out of my face, squiddy. You are now gone. I'm getting past you. Oh, we had the fireball. 
He's not gonna come back. There he is. Yay, fire underwater. I love it. I don't really know what these... Are they supposed to be... Is this the end? That is it? Oh my goodness. Well, that was very short. That appears to be World 9. If it's anything like the rest of them, they will be only four long. And is that going to be it? World 9-1, it just keeps repeating? Holy bananas. I wonder if it gets harder, like Dark Souls or something. I, I doubt it will be. It probably just keeps going to say, Yeah, you done it, but you want to keep playing? Here's four more levels that are easy as shit to do. Maybe there's like a secret or something. Oh, there we go. Okay. I'm just gonna stop it there because I think it might just keep looping around. There doesn't seem to be anything new from the other ones. But that has been Mario Lost Levels. It's been a great game. I sure I sure summed it up in the last one when I thought it had ended. But I had fun playing it. I also went through a lot of troubles playing it because it'd be a pretty challenging one. It's a lot more challenging than any other Mario game I've played before, but since this has been a really short episode, and I do want to keep playing Mario, like, I, there's another game, I hopefully it's on the Wii, I hope this is. We're gonna go check it out, see if it's on the Wii. And here we have it. So Mario 2 has been fun, but this is my favorite Mario game, Super Mario World. And this is gonna be the next one that I play on my Mario. On oh, my Mario, yes, I love playing Mario. But it's gonna be one I'm gonna be playing next in the Mario categories on my channel. So I just thought I'd let you guys know that I will be playing some more Mario games, even though we have completed the second one. This one isn't gonna be as challenging, I mean, especially not the start. There's gonna be more levels. It's gonna be an absolute blast. I can't wait to play it, but that will probably be like next week or something. But anyway, I'm gonna end this episode here, so thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed, and you come back and join me some more Mario you fun when we start up the Super Mario World. The first Mario World. I almost said two because we're playing the last levels, but anyway, that's enough. All right, peace out. I'm gonna hurry it up a little. Okay. Oh, another checkpoint. Awesome. <laughs> oh, that's my gap. Okay, that's great news. Go. I was totally in there. I go. Yeah. Oh, no. I was on the tile, man. All right. We made it. Amazing. I don't know why that took so long.